Good morning, my beautiful and amazing people. Welcome, welcome back to another episode of the discussion. I with me, a lovely host, Faith Charles, and definitely today it's health wednesday ask a doctor and you guys asked for it you're like oh faith charles you know we need us a professional not you know to just come and talk about talk to us about mental health yes we discussed but not in that much depth and remember you can talk to us via social media handles that is lsm tv all social media platforms and also sms line that is zero seven two one six nine five three eight four I will repeat it for you guys. 0721695384. And today I have a guest with me here and she is Salma. She's a community health worker. Karibu sana. Santi sana. Thank you so much. Karibu. Faith. Yes. You can start by telling us uh, what you do, Salma. Okay. Uh -huh. Thank you so much. Uh, my official names are Salome Njerimbogwa but um, commonly known and known well as Denik Salma Wadev, Kiambu County, Kabete Sub County, Udhiru Ward. Mm -hmm. I'm a Nyumba Kume member, mm -hmm. I'm a community health worker mm -hmm. or volunteer. I'm also an advocate mm -hmm. to youth and girls' rights, mm -hmm. and I'm also the CEO or the chair ready to the rescue team. Okay. Yeah. And today we are talking about mental health. Uh, maybe just briefly just uh, define to us what mental health is because we're just like not everyone knows uh, exactly maybe how to define it. Okay. Yes. Mental health, it is a state of well-being. Mm -hmm. It can be emotional, spiritually, psychologically, mm -hmm. or socially. Mm -hmm. It enables one mm -hmm. to deal with day-to-day -day stress, mm -hmm. enabling them and helping them to mm -hmm acquire all learn more about their abilities mm -hmm. yeah and uh, okay and we 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 have to to, to say that it's very important yeah. that we need to check on mental health and just to ensure our mental state is right yeah. maybe you could just tell us some of the mental health disorders okay we mm -hmm. have uh, some of the mental health disorders mm -hmm. one of them being Mm -hmm. uh, there is mood disorder mm -hmm. and there is anxiety disorder. Mm -hmm. We all know what anxiety is. It is a uh, fear of unknown mm -hmm. or worry. Mm -hmm. And we also have personality disorder. Mm -hmm. Personality disorder, that is uh, that is uh, the way of the, the, the way of a person's thinking mm -hmm. and the way they do their things. Mm -hmm. And we also have uh, OCD. Mm -hmm. That is. Uh, Obsessive compulsive disorder. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that is mm -hmm. uh, excessive thoughts. Yes. Yeah, that lead to unwanted behaviors. Yes. Yeah. And maybe you could tell us. Uh, you've told us the the, the the mental health disorder. Some of the mental health disorders. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe what what results to to some of those uh, disorders. Okay, maybe some of those disorders result due to maybe uh, early, uh, early childhood, the way maybe someone was brought up. Mm -hmm. It can be through trauma, yes. a trauma, uh, a trauma, maybe a traumatic event that you underwent when you were a child. Mm -hmm. It can also be uh, through violence. Mm -hmm. Maybe you have undergone a violent stage in your life. Mm -hmm. And it can also be uh, mm -hmm. through... Mm -hmm. It can also be through. Okay, for now it's only those. Yes. Yeah. Okay, and uh, maybe um, tell us maybe what are the signs and uh, that we need to watch out for. Okay, the signs are, let's say like when you find a traumatized person, mm -hmm. that person doesn't speak much. Yes. That person is worries a lot, mm -hmm. and it's worry of unknown. Mm -hmm. There is also lack of appetite. Yes. There is also when you sleep a lot. Yes. There is also when you eat a lot. Yeah, eating disorder. Yeah. Yes. And there is also when you when you do a lot of habits that you are not doing previously. You mm -hmm. like kind of exaggerate. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And and maybe one could be like um okay. Okay, and uh, you've said some of the signs and the symptoms to watch out for. 
and uh, what are those you've mentioned some of the mental health disorders mm -hmm. and maybe you could just like take us through one by one so that we know what what we need to watch out for okay yes uh the persona like i said the anxiety disorder yes in anxiety mm -hmm. that is when you find that ocd Mm -hmm. OCD, OCD is a disorder. Yes. A obsessive, compulsive disorder. Mm -hmm. It is a disorder that a lot of people tend to ignore. Mm -hmm. They don't know that they have. Mm -hmm. It is like, for for example, it happens to new, newly newly mothers, the mothers who have already given birth. Is it the same as the postpartum depression? Not really, uh -huh. but it's kind of rages the same yeah. because you, you find in their situation, mm -hmm. like they have given birth. Yes. The way they wash their clothes mm -hmm. and the way they hang them mm. uh, and the, the kind of mode they hang them mm -hmm. and the pegs they used to hang them. Mm -hmm. You can find that uh, maybe you've had uh, a baby girl and mm -hmm. you just want you want your clothes to follow like in line. Yes. You want to start with the small two panties, the two blouse, yeah. the two trousers, and they have to be like in line of pegs. Mm -hmm. The pink one and the white one. Mm -hmm. Let's say maybe you give someone a kibarua to do that kind mm -hmm. of work. Yes. And you find that they have used the wrong pegs. Or maybe mm -hmm. they have started with the trousers yes. and they, they have ended with the... It's not the, the alignment. The, it's not there. Yeah. So you feel disturbed a lot until you mm -hmm. change it yourself mm -hmm. you'll feel comfortable when you go and change it it also it also happens in our day-to-day -day lives mm -hmm. like at home you find uh, at how at a house mm -hmm. there is this sufuria that we have of ugali and there's mm. this one of uh, stew yes. and there's this one of tea of rice yes maybe like mm -hmm. it has it happens in my home yes. uh, my mom used to to fight a lot with us because of that mm -hmm. and we didn't know it, it is a disorder by the way yes. you find like you for example you have mistakenly taken the the sufuria for tea mm. and you have cooked ugali with it yes. my friend you will have to suffer for it because she knows and she's brought up with that kind of i don't know if it is i can say it it is a disorder that that it sufuria means, it is meant for tea alone and the other one is meant for ugali but and i think it's, it's meant for we don't know i've i've i never knew it's a disorder but i think that is actually most of our african women do mm -hmm. there's that there's, there's that sufuria for ugali there's mm -hmm. that you know, for tea, for rice, so it's a disorder. Yeah, oh it is my a God. disorder. Uh -huh. And most people I'm a suffer. Victim. <laughs> <laughs> and most people suffer from it without knowing. Yes. Yeah, but it is treatable. Yes. Yeah. So what are maybe oh you said the signs mm -hmm. and how is it treatable? Okay. It is a disorder just like any other. Mm -hmm. Let me just move into the other disorder, then I'll tell you how it is. Okay, no problem. All of them the same. Uh -huh. We have a bipolar, bipolar yes. disorder. I don't yeah. know if you've ha heard about it. I've heard, but uh, maybe yeah. don't this is that in depth. Yeah. I have no idea. These are episodes of mood swings. Mm -hmm. You find someone has a lot of mood swings. Mm -hmm. At some level, it goes low and mm -hmm. at another level mm -hmm. if not treated or tamed mm -hmm. it goes to a much higher mm -hmm. height is it because uh, most of us women are uh, usually have mood swings especially during our mm -hmm. periods mm -hmm. uh, but f during our periods you find that it's it's maybe uh it's limited you mm -hmm. find that it's maybe from this duration like you know it's a week and is it the same or are the bipolar it's much worse than that not really the the bipolar is much worse mm -hmm. because the the ones for the menstruation yes. just like you've said that mm -hmm. one we know the cause yeah and after the menstruation is gone mm -hmm. we go back to our normal State. living mm -hmm. but this one now mm -hmm. of the bipolar mm -hmm. it is a condition a disorder yeah yeah so what you said so maybe what are its causes causes of bipolar yes it is just like uh, it is just like anxiety. Uh -huh. It is just like uh, the way you control your thinking. Uh -huh. All those things you control your thinking, you are doing of of, of ways. Mm -hmm. Because uh, remember, as we talk about mental health, uh -huh. we are talking about uh, we are talking about mental here. Yeah, brain precisely, yes. mm -hmm. and the mind. And yeah. we all know that the brain and the mind, yes, they are function in mm -hmm. the same place, mm -hmm. but they don't function the same way. Mm -hmm. Because the brain, the brain 
is tangible, yes. but the mind is not. Mm -hmm. So the mind is the one that conjects mm -hmm. all this information. So, and regarding, mm -hmm. we are different. Yeah. The way you relate to something is mm -hmm. not the way I relate to another, True. to that particular thing. Mm -hmm. So the way of relating to things also varies with different kinds of personalities and mm -hmm. people. Yeah, and we also have another disorder that I almost forgot. Mm -hmm. uh, psychotic disorder. Mm -hmm. Psychotic disorder, that is where we find a disease called schizophrenia. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you've heard about it. Schizophrenia, it is a disease or a disorder. Let me call it a disorder, not a disease. It mm -hmm. is a disorder where about it affects the ability, that candidate's ability, mm -hmm. to feel, mm -hmm. think, mm -hmm. or act in a normal way. You find in mm -hmm. such a disorder, mm -hmm. like uh, it happens mostly in like students and pupils and parents hardly know about it because mm -hmm. it's hidden. Mm -hmm. You find like uh, a, a teacher is teaching in class, mm -hmm. but the, the child or the pupil is not concentrating mm -hmm. because they have this disorder. Mm -hmm. They tend to sleep a lot, mm -hmm. they tend to lose focus, mm -hmm. but though they tend to do all that, mm -hmm. these people are very sharp. Mm -hmm. Once they come back, they don't forget. Mm -hmm. yeah. but, I, but I thought that when that moment you're in school, it's maybe because we woke up early or maybe because the mind is tired and you're like, it's, it's, like, it's like you're like, oh, it's like a student routine to, to sleep in class. So it's actually a disorder. Not really. Mm -hmm. You'll be able to tell mm -hmm. if it is tiredness because uh, when you're tired and you take a nap, mm -hmm. obviously it goes away. Yeah. But you find mm -hmm. that this pupil or this student mm -hmm. is sleeping continuously in classes every mm -hmm. single day mm -hmm. at a particular time. Yeah. They are kind of, whenever you teach, they are kind of, they get tired quickly. Mm. So that is, that can be related as a sign of uh, a sign of mental disorder. Yeah, mental disorder. And also another one is depression. Yeah. Depression actually affects five percent of adults mm -hmm. every day in this life. Mm -hmm. Because a lot of people suffer depression without knowing. Exactly. Without Very knowing. True. And it is a disorder, it is treatable. Mm -hmm. But now before it reaches to depression, mm -hmm. you undergo through the stress, day-to-day -day stresses, yes. the way you manage them, the way they get treated, mm -hmm. that is what matters before it varies to depression. Mm -hmm. yeah. And uh, before before we go move on to uh, how to deal with uh, grief, guys, we're going for a very quick break. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. <laughs> 